Hey guys, it's Smiley Quanta. Welcome back to my channel. Smile for me. It's Sinquanta Cocksmith of www.sinquantacocksmith.com. Today I'm back with another series and we will be talking about money making ideas. So if you want to learn how to make more money in your business and increase your income as a side hustler or a nine to fiver, this is the series for you. So make sure you hit the notification bell, subscribe to the channel, and look forward to all these videos throughout the month of February. Hello guys, I am Sinquanta Cox Smith, and today we are going to be going through the digital products, um, a part of the money making, the making money ideas series. And I'm super excited to talk about digital products to you guys, so I hope you guys enjoy this presentation. All right, so... Today's discussion, we will cover what is a digital product, what type of digital product you can offer, what tools you need, how to create a digital product, and additional products to create. All of this will kind of just flow inside of this video. All right, so what is a digital product? A product that is delivered or stored electronically. It can be downloaded downloaded, email, or viewed. So many of you have um, probably already purchased a digital product, but you've never thought about even creating a digital product. Know that when I say it can be email, it could be as simple as an email challenge. It can be download. It is something as simple as a picture you draw that is digitally emailed and downloaded it to the person and they print it at home. And something that they can view is exactly what you are watching right now. What you are watching is a form of a digital product that I am presenting to you for free. So this is just an overview of my Gumroad store where I sell my digital products. Okay, so what type of digital product can you offer? Written format. The written format includes ebook, workbooks, worksheets, and templates. So this is an ebook here showing you on my phone. Um, this is my how to self-publish for under $100 ebook. It's showing you on the phone because that's where you can look at an ebook. Um, that was mainly what ebooks were for, for your phones and iPads and Kindle devices. But you can now read ebooks on the computer um, through your email. Workbooks are things that you can either print out, but it was received digitally from someone else. Someone sent you a workbook or a worksheet and you printed it out and you are using it to work through it. Now we can also work on workbooks, worksheets, and templates digitally from our iPads by using Apple Pencils. So these are just a variety of things that you can use. Another written format would be a digital a planner that someone can send to you and create for you for you to constantly write through it and plan out your day. What type of digital product can you offer? Again, audio. What you are listening to is an audio um, training, but if I took away the visual part of it, it would be strictly my voice and you would just be listening to it. So uh, audio uh, digital product can be music that you send to somebody. It could be a playlist. That's a digital product that you created a playlist and you offer it for listening um, pleasure. A podcast is an audio digital product that people receive consistently through audio. And then also audio trainings where all you hear is the audio as someone walks you through step-by-step -step process to something. All right, y'all had to pause real quick, but I am back. Um, so again, like I was saying, Oh, I didn't have my mic on. Okay, so I am back. And like I was saying, the type of digital product you can offer um, with the audios is audios trainings as well, where um, someone may sign up for something. Instead of giving them a video, you just basically produce audio trainings for them to listen to and work through. And I do like listening to stuff by audio because it gives me a chance to do other things, but also I'm listening and I can take notes. So I love um, audio trainings. All right, again, another type of digital product you can offer are videos. So you can do webinars, they can be live, and then you can sell the replays. You can do workshops, which include in-person workshops. Oh, no, sorry, we're talking about digital. You can do workshops where um, people join together online at a certain time and date, and you teach something. Uh, you can do consults where you 
uh, have people on the phone and they call and you can also record that call and provide that digital uh, video for them to uh, watch after you're done. I often do that as well. Or you could provide, provide courses through videos where people can watch a course and learn how to do something um, much like what we are doing right now. <laughs> All right, so what type of digital product can you offer? Again, what to offer? Um, Ebooks, masterclasses, webinars, courses, memberships, and consult. This is just additional digital products that you can offer. Um, when it comes to masterclasses, it's like, uh, I would say like the highest level of a digital product when you add masterclass this is something that is amazing and it's probably at a higher price tier um, webinars are really good to get um, traffic consistently coming to your business and uh, along with uh, the courses that can keep money coming into your business memberships and uh, also consoles. So memberships is where they pay a price for something either monthly, yearly, uh, bi, bi monthly to receive um, digital products, courses, products, workshops, etc. I love saying et cetera, though. I just let you know. So what are tools you need? Here are some of the tools and resources that I recommend. Canva, Gumroad, Microsoft Word, Google Docs, InDesign, Gumroad, Shopify, Wix, PayHip, SendOut, Zoom, Webinar Jam, Easy Webinar, Vimo, PowerPoint, Google Slides, Loom, Screencast, and Teachable. These are just a few. Some are paid and you have to pay more and some are in the free range for you to get started. Also, how to create a digital product. So you would need your topic first and format. Um, First and foremost, what are you going to talk about? What are you going to sell? So here, I decided on Canva Custom. I am going to sell a digital course on Canva Custom, and it's going to be a video course. So that's my format. This course will be a digital video format. And then, you, of course, you need your sell page. It's kind of what you see here. Um, I have a Canva Custom. I have my website. I basically go overview of what I'm going to teach you. I'm going to teach you custom interior and how to do interior manuscripts, custom covers for workbooks, journals, and stationery. So once you have your uh, your sales page ready on whatever site uh, you decide to use, then you can set that up. All right, so here I included a quick video on teaching you how to quickly get your digital products together using Gumroad, using um, Ice Cream Cast, and Canva. So click on the screen um, while you're watching this part to quickly go to that video and you can watch it and then you can come back to the end of the training. And that basically concludes our digital product video for today. So if you are looking to purchase a digital product from me, just make sure you visit my Gumroad, gumroad.com backslash and Quantico Smith. And as always, I'm inspiring everyone to live their dreams. And you can check out my website at www.sinquantacocksmith.com. And I am on Instagram at sinquantacocksmith. Again, and as always, thank you guys for watching. And until next time, I love you more than I love this video. Peace.